in the exceptional responders after the very first dose uh, that we administer intravenously, four or five hours later, the pain would start to go away and we would get the patients back 24 hours later, one day later for a scan and review the patient and they would say, my pain has disappeared. And one patient comes to mind, his wife was an oncology nurse and she is retired and she said, I've never seen a response like this in, in all my oncology career. He's gone from sort of almost wheelchair bound to two weeks later, mowing the grass uh, again. So a really remarkable improvement in quality of life. We're interested in developing targeted radiopharmaceuticals. Th that is radioactive particles that can be delivered just to tumor cells and not to normal cells so that we can radiate the tumor without radiating uh, normal cells. It's like going out into the sun and sitting out there for too long and getting a sunburn. Uh, that's a form of radiation from the sun. Uh, here it would be like getting a really, really bad sunburn uh, to these tumours and killing them. But with a one millimetre path length, there's not too much damage to normal tissue around. So it's a very novel way to kill tumours wherever they are in the body uh, without harming normal tissues. We recognised uh, very early on that this molecule that got named PSMA was in fact highly specific to prostate cancer cells. And as a result, uh, provided us with a potential target that we could go after uh, by developing an antibody that would bind only to PSMA. Uh, and we could use that antibody as a targeting vehicle. We could put payloads, a variety of payloads on that antibody. So we could put a radiopharmaceutical on the, on the antibody. Uh, we could put uh, drugs on the antibody. Uh, we could put imaging agents uh, on the antibody. Uh, and so it becomes a very modular approach to allow us to, um, to do a variety of, of, of things for patients. PSMA imaging, I believe, will be um, uh, approved by the FDA in, in the coming months. And so um, maybe in, in relatively short order, we'll start to see the first uh, PSMA uh, targeted therapeutic uh, more broadly available to patients. Uh, we see response, good responses in around 60% of patients, meaning improved quality of life, uh, decreased pain, PSA dropping by more than half. So at least three quarters of patients are seeing those sorts of responses. So for a patient out there who does not know what the Prostate Can Cancer Foundation is, uh, I would like them to know that they are truly funding the most innovative research around the planet uh, in all corners and, and they do this very quickly. Uh, most of the money is going towards uh, research and they have a very fast evaluation process so that that money is going from you uh, to the research it's much faster than many other uh, equivocal charities or particularly government funding bodies uh, around the world and this will hopefully uh, achieve our aim of you know, decreasing deaths from prostate cancer and eliminating our prostate cancer globally. Music